And so what we have here right now in front of us is a bike. It's a very beautiful bike that looks like a titanium or an aluminum from afar, but it's actually acromoly. It says in the sticker right above in there, a small one. It's chromolybdenum and a very big chromoly. It's a BR4 technical analysis control system. BR4, that's the model of this chromoly and there's the big ridge runner on the down tube as you can see so this is uh, basically coming from japan you can see the welds over there and here's the badge which is the letter m this is actually from miyata a very well-known company here's the uh, serial number that is being stamped in the in the head tube and uh, it is equipped with cantilever so i'm holding right now this grip that i can't figure what the brand is but some of uh, written japanese characters over there probably the name of the previous owner and as you can see some rust are all over the handlebar but not that worse and it still functions i mean the, the lever and then the shifter uh, the cantilever brakes are all f functioning well as I've tested and it's a fat 1024MEX tubing I think that's the name of this fork and then the material inscribed over there and then the crank set it's by Shimano as well as the front derailleur here's the tactical technical something something that's the ridge runner badge in the seat tube and uh, as i counted it's seven speed cogs and uh to reveal the year of this bicycle i if this if this is really the exact seat post that's being used so i took it off because it's not uh, stopped luckily And so as I checked it, it says the diameter of the seat post which is 29.2 and down there, there's the 2010. So there you go, that's the year when this bicycle was being manufactured, was released or it was just a stamp seat post and it was just installed through this uh, model of this bicycle but we can never tell unless somebody else from the company would give us those information and so here's the final chance for us to check the frame on the opposite side so uh, basing from the tubings and the stickers there's a lot of scratches here and there so hearing from this really huge tubing of this chrome molly that looks like an aluminum the set stays uh, as you can see there are uh, noticeably a lot of rust actually but it's not deeply affecting the condition of the frame overall uh, of course dust because of the years and then i notice also the hubs those hubs aren't a highly specced of course and so basically we can ultimately uh, conclude that this is an entry-level bicycle basing from those things that we saw so this uh, handle grip is still nicely looking grip but it's so sticky so better avoid this and throw it whenever we will restore this in the future including the saddle is quietly mismatched and also the pedal and upgrade this plastic pedal but entirely this is a quite nice bike 